Good morning and welcome to this week's tutorial. Okay, so I'm going to be going for a bit of a basics introduction throughout the Adobe Photoshop package. Um, in which case that means going through the tools we have on the left hand side. Quick two to five minute video explaining their function and how they can help with our workflow. Brilliant. Okay, and to start off with, we are going to be exploring the pen tool. Tools I have with me today is my MacBook Air, my Wacom Interest Pro Paper Edition tablet, and an old photograph that I thought would be pretty cool to trace. The pen tool is a simple selection feature that helps you draw, fill, stroke from your selected artwork. And we are going to be quickly exploring that further. You don't need a graphics tablet to use the tool. You can do it by mouse or trackpad sometimes. And we'll be exploring both of those and I'll tell you when I switch between. Okay, to start off with, I am going to be using the graphics tablet just to explain my original layer is locked and the reason it's locked is because when I've practiced this tutorial I have accidentally started to trace onto the original layer which can kind of confuse the workflow when trying to complete the trace. Okay, so I'm going to go to my pen tool which is this tool here and to start off with as I'm using a graphics tablet I'm going to use a free from pen tool and if I zoom in, I will draw around this leaf here. Now because it is relying on my hand to guide the tool, not quite as straight as it should be. Okay, so we have a freely drawn selection. And what we're going to do is we're going to fill that selection. The window. Yeah. Fill path. Pick our colour there. There we go. That is a very quick visit to the pen tool. Awesome. Now I'm going to switch from using my graphics tablet to my trackpad. And to get rid of this blue border here, we click our work path, drag it down, and there we go. Bish bash boom. Okay, back to layers, zoom back in, and this time we will focus on this leaf here, why not? Okay, so P, back to our pen tool, now select this over, okay, select copy. Okay, so you see, if I try to click here, it's going to naturally do this curve. The reason why is because our anchor is pulling it away from the center. So what we need to do, if I can Z to take that away, go to our bar, we've got convert point tool. Just drag it to a location where we're going to want to be, bring it back to our pen tool and then there we go. Okay. 
Okay, back to our paths. Fill the path. Colour, stroke, feather radius. Okay, and there we have it. We have a quick demonstration to the pen tool and how it can help with our workflow. Okay, if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And for now, remember, stay kind. Bye.